what motivated me to write the book. So I am obviously on social media very often. Um, that's mostly where I get to speak for myself and that's mostly where I get to talk and be able to tell stories and say things that I enjoy saying. But I feel like a book is something completely different. No one gets to comment on it. There's no, hey, it's me telling you all stories and telling you all what life has been like before. And I feel like that's something so awesome that I don't have to worry about what the comments are gonna say because at the end of the day, this is something that is entirely me. And I'm very proud of it and very excited. And I really hope that you guys like it. Um, okay. This one is from Madison. How does it feel to do this? So with this, I assume you're talking about the book and I would say it feels pretty crazy. I feel like that's the only way that I know how to describe it. I mean, I always enjoyed reading, um, especially growing up when I was a lot younger and probably about elementary school. And I always really liked writing and telling stories. And that was something that I really enjoyed and I really admired authors that could tell stories so well. And the fact that I'm able to tell stories about myself and my life is 10 times more insane. Definitely never thought that I would come out with a book and have, there's 798 people on here that are interested in the stories I have to tell and that's that's pretty incredible but once again very crazy okay do 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 okay this one is a good one this one's for car from Carla and Carla asked what inspired you to build a platform for me I started posting on social media like most teenagers my age do. Um, and throughout that, I gained a following. And there's a difference between a following and a platform. Because a platform means that you have people that are going to listen to what you say. And I think that that's something incredibly difficult to have, but incredibly amazing. And it gives me opportunities to be able to do things like this and be able to answer your questions and be able to talk to you all and I feel like that's something very very awesome and very exciting and I was given this moment and I decided to do my best to make the most out of it and I feel like that's what I'm doing right now um hmm. oh this one's a good one this one is from Marta and Marta asked, what is my favorite sticker in the book? So let's turn to the sticker page. I would say that my favorite sticker in the book is this little banner with my name on it. That one right there. I think it's really cute. I was the kid that liked to write my notes with the little banners in it and color coordinate them. So I would definitely say that one or the hearts because I love little hearts. They're so cute. Um, let's see. Who has impacted me the most on my journey? So Addison asked this question, and I would have to say there has been definitely a lot of people, some people that have really taken the time to talk to me. Um, Emma Chamberlain, I would say J-Lo, I would say James Charles. There's so many people. Some people I I like to keep our interactions to really myself and the other person because they have just been so incredibly special to me, but there has definitely been lots of people that I've had that have impacted me on my life, but throughout this journey, it's been pretty insane, but so many people have been nothing but sweet to me and makes me very happy. Um, what gave me inspiration? So this um, question is from Michael. And what gave me in inspiration? I would say dance gave me a huge inspiration. I would say my family and my friends are huge 
uh, inspiring me to be the best person that I can be and always push harder. I would say my team that is around me, they definitely push me to be the best version of myself and try new things and, and really have fun with what is going on in my life. Um, next question is from Charlotte. Can you share your favorite page from the book? Yes. Let me find it. Thanks. Okay, let me make sure I get the right one. So I would have to say <laughs> literally any pages from the, the friends category. But other than that, I would have to say my little baby pictures. Because I feel like this really just shows growth. 